The Global Voices Local Choices Project is a collaboration between the African Caribbean Support Organization of Northern Ireland, National Museums, Northern Ireland, and Northern Ireland Museums Council. The aim is to bring diverse cultures and perspectives into local and national museums across Northern Ireland. In terms of achievement, we are delighted that the participants enjoyed being on the program they report feeling empowered, having their voice heard in the museum space. And equally for the organizations, they feel that they have achieved their aim of bringing diverse cultures and diverse perspectives into the museums. This is a traditional coffee pot, which is called Jebana. Uh, it's used in Eritrean coffee making. This coffee pot is made up of clay. Uh, it has a handle and a spot and a stand which is made from straw. Why not use uh, a pot which is made up of uh, glass or metal? Uh, it is because this, if you put a ground coffee, roasted coffee uh, beans inside, mix it with water, it, the water can stay very hot for a long time. So it brings, it represents uh, f bringing families together, closeness. That's why it's widely used uh, in my culture and also women. It's made by women. Belonging the museum, a Mao game, it's played in more in um, uh, quite a bit of African countries. Um, in Malawi, it's known as Bao. I played it in Malawi when I was a child. It's curved in Malawi. Malawi is known for curving, wood curvings. So it's decorated in the back with the African, and then just the game in the front. And it's played with um, tiny little wooden beads or stones. Okay, regarding of of uh, Turban, Emma, you know, uh, all the Sudanese, you know, uh, uh, despite the uh, the Sudan West area, uh, and many tribes living in in, in Sudan, they uh, have uh, a different culture. But uh, the most popular uh, men, the most popular men fashion is Emma, you know, and they they wear it alongside with uh, this hat, they put it first in the head, like this. The weather is hot there. When they wear it, they protect their, their themselves from the sunshine. So this is called Buddha. It's, it's, it's a top, it's a blouse. It's it's always straight, but you know, as civilization goes on, we tend to shape in clothes to fit us and bring out shapes in our body, you know? So that's why this is made, and I made this myself. I used to make dress back home, and there was a time I had this, this material. A friend gave it to me, it was a very small piece, so I, I kept it with me for a long time. So when I got this fabric, it's called guinea. So I I was like, I love to make something with the fabric, but so I remembered I have something like this at home. So I used to, I used it to mix it to just beautify it and it came out well and people loved it.